opening and they're taking their time getting forward here. You want to feel out your opponents. Oh, comes that fault line. Takas is going to take control. That 10k is stuck in the back there. Oh, he's going to be hit down by that. Has to jump up next to the turret, but Logan is taken down alive. In the meantime, Takas is finding two. Pushes through, gets 10k and punked. Resident the saving grace with one pick over towards A, but the rest of the, uh, the BDS team, they are fully pushed up onto B and they can plant down this spike now, Geo. Yep, no issues there. It'll be fine as to kind of come in from behind to see if they can get a couple of picks. There's one from Foxy. At this point, I don't know what their likelihood of doing a retake is. It's a two versus three, so it could certainly happen. But with Foxy falling, I'm not sure those chances stand. It's just Resident alive now, full HP. The recon dart, it's destroyed. It won't find him out exactly, but they know he's around that location now. He's taking shots onto Hoppy, he's taking shots onto Akuma, finds one, he's only down onto 10 HP now. He's going to push himself around the corner, trying to find Roden there through the wall. He's going to throw out the paint grenade, try and catch him out, but Roden finds it first. But they want to be sure everything in front of them is perfectly set up for it. There's a live with the first pick, and Resident one with the... Uh, oh, finest! I mean, they're just finding picks left and right. Hoppy will try and take some... Through comes the fault line. Out. Oh, two, two revealed with that recon dart, but oh, Takas, he throws himself into a corner where he's blinded and punked. Oh, he's punked. there with three. It's punked. Get punked. And Foxy takes down Logan. It's all down now to Hoppy by himself. He has his dragon friend, but how much he's going to be able to do? Turning around the corner, he finds a headshot onto Foxy, looking for Resident now. Oh, but oh no, he turns around at the wrong time. Gets headshot through the wall, looking for a lie, but a lie will finish it out from behind. For it. Here comes the aftershock. He's going to try and find out alive. And oh no, the spray. It hits one shot, but the rest of it is just off to the side. Hoppy, in the meantime, taking out Foxy there. I like the amount of names that end with a Y. It simply makes the team sound very cute. <laughs> I mean... Foxy. Yeah. Oh, the rolling thunder is caught out alive and he's going to be taken down with the blade storm in hand. Now they can use this to push forward. They're taking their time though. 10k is starting to put up smokes. The flash onto 10k. That's going to, well, I mean, straight in the face. How, how, how much more flash can you get? He turns around the corner and he's going to get sprayed down by Roden and the rest of the team. Out comes the fault line and that's perfectly onto Punk. Punk has actually taken one down just before he got stunned there. But the teleporter play is coming out from BDS now. And as well as the cosmic divide, they're going to get the plant. Yeah, trying to prevent the uh, last two defenders from being left. able to have any info. He's heading towards long now instead of taking that hookah position. Roden, he's going to turn around the corner. He's ha he, he hits one. Oh, and out comes a show but in from behind. That's massive. Only finds one, but oh, and alive. He comes in with a shorty. No, Hobby will spray him down through the smoke. Find his second as well, and they've got him through onto site now. Two players left on the finest side. It's Punked and Resident. If anybody can do it with those ARs, they can. Oh, but no. Punked is going to get Punked himself, and Rodan will finish off Resident their lives. But out comes now the lockdown, and they're going to try and push back against the BDS team. Turn up the heat. BDS, in the meantime, Logan has pushed up through a short. Ooh, they take the teleporter, and now I think they're heading back towards A. Mm -hmm. Playing yeah. it very slowly, yeah. Now, a lot of this defensive positioning and utility is still over on the B site. And to be fair, BDS haven't really moved anywhere to suggest that's going to change, especially with Roden and now Takas getting some kills to open it up further. I don't see them getting away from the B site. Yeah, they're going to get that spike down now because they've opened up avenues to take that through. Sure, I think Finest might want to try saving this one. I think that's why we're seeing one player posted up just... Uh, over towards A there, 10k. You can see him, he's just waiting for, well, I mean, exits over the other side of the map, maybe? I don't know. Resident, he's... It's like a... I can't even... I can't even think, like, Outlast. He's running away from <laughs> everything. Oh, no, the monster is coming from him. There we go. He, he, he takes down Akuma, so he's going to get away now, so... And to make sure he's not getting too far forward, now they've pushed him away from that weapon. He's not going to be picking it up, and he's actually revealed here, so... Going to have to back up well into sight before that shock dart takes him out. Now, oh... It's a brilliant stun. It'll take down two there. That only so flash, but not actually any kills in 10k. He takes down Roden. Hoppy now picking up the operator. He's going to try and pick up the pieces, but not much he can do now. The fault line. Logan again taking up a pick over towards A and Akuma. He's going to take the teleporter as the whole team rotates through the. Oh, the lockdown is going to actually make it difficult for Foxy to get through, and Logan is going to make it even more difficult with a clean headshot. Back to a 3v3. Finest coming in from behind. Spike Two players planted. from Link here, one from CT. We've got one player watching CT, so that fight will be coming down here. But Ponked, he's quick. 
with the operator shot coming down onto Hoppy. They're going to be able to push through, through two avenues here, and it looks like BDS are kind of being pincered. Tenke, he's moving in from CT, and Alive, in the meantime, is making moves over towards Sight. Akuma, though, massive on the first shot. Makes it a 2v2. It's just Tenke pushing around the corner now. Akuma finds one, and Logan will pick up the rest. He likes to run back across the map and go for these other engagements where... He's pushed away the team from one, but Roden, he's there to stop that from happening. Takes one pick onto Alive. Alive, obviously, not with the Operator. It's going to be more difficult for him to found, find that shot. It's back to a 4v4. Still three ults in the hands of the finest team, but Punk looks away before Akuma turns around the corner. Here comes the Orbital Strike to deny the plant. Is. Tenke, yep. That's going to push Akuma straight into Tenke's barrel, and through the finest players come. Tenke, another another pick onto Hoppy. 30 seconds left. The Seekers are going to find out the rest of the players now. It's Logan turning around the corner, as well as Roden. The Flash finds both of them, but Anissa playing it slow. The spike is down, and BDS have to push forward to get it. Resident is just holding down that position. I think, I think somebody's coming from CT. No, not at all, but they're going to... They pick up the spike, and they actually do go through the teleport. Do they have enough time to plant? This is great from them. Well, the defenders know. They heard, but I'm look, there there's not tons of time. They are going to get it down. Oh, nice kill. Okay. Really close range there from Roden. So it's oh. just Logan on his own to try and protect. No... Foxy will be able to heal up 10k, but this guy is such a selfless character. He's going to be left on 1 HP himself. Now, oh, the wolf is going to stun up Logan. Yeah, unless he can... He can find the shots. Oh, but... He, he, he's stuck with his knives out. And, uh, oh, Roden. He'll find one onto Reston. They've already pushed through. The fault line actually clips there. Uh, alive, but Tenke, he's the he's the bastion of A. He's holding down there. Logan, oh, turning around at the corner. Alive onto one oh. and alive onto two as well. He turns okay. around the corner with the four. Alive. Look at that. There it is. There's Alive. Find that shot. No, Alive is going to turn around the corner through his own smoke. Gets round into CT. BDS are starting to rotate. Look at this. They're coming through and they're actually going to come up behind. Roden is holding oh. it down. He takes two picks. The shock dart comes out. It'll do a little bit of damage to Foxy. Another one coming through, but oh, the shot. No, he can't find it. Roden taken down now, but oh, they're all stunned up, and Akuma, he's going to take down Alive, it's just Foxy left. Well, not just Foxy left, but oh, just Foxy left in heaven, he's taken down, it's just 10k now. Looking for that pick onto Logan, he'll find one, but Takus is there with the trade, and ouch. Trailblazers also going to be adding on to the information, 10k taken down right at the same time. Yeah, didn't land too many shots there either, so not much damage done. Alive, oh! Oh, lovely. That uh, that uh, vulnerability gave Alive no chance against the one tap from the Spectre on the other side. Oh, no. Logan picks up a gun at the wrong time. Ponct is going to take that one down. It's now 3v4. This is winnable for Finest, but they need to push in as soon as they can. There's 17 seconds left. Get that spike down. The shock dart will come out. i will do a lot of damage. And the recon dart afterwards. Oh, we'll find out Punk turning around the corner. Rodan will find that first pick. There's only two players left on the Resident side. On the Finest side, sorry. But Resident is the first player who's going to peek. Now the Flash. Oh, Resident finds one. The Flash coming around. That's going to catch both players. And he takes one down. The Seekers. Finding where both players are. The spray down. Not quite going to find a kill. And Hoppy will finish it out. Leave it as it is. Akuma, he's holding an elbow. Out comes the Rolling Thunder. And that's going to hit all of the finest players. And Akuma, he picks up the pieces. Turning around the corner. One onto Resident. He's going to come onto site. Akuma with the second. Almost with the third. Punk will finish it out. But that Flash is massive. And Hoppy just sprays him down through the wall. There's two players left. One over towards Elbow. One. Oh, Rodan. He's there with the trade. It's a live left. No. Shots. Oh, he finds a headshot. But Rodan, again. Various pieces of utility. And everybody is set up and know exactly what they're going to do to act off of it worked out very well for them so far and now they find themselves on map point here in map number and it's going to try and catch out the players he hits one onto resident no alive doesn't land the shots logan will take him down without taking a single point of damage he'll take down 10k as well a spray onto resident it's punked and foxy to clean it up but there's a good he caught out in this fake here we go set up the normal wall and the snake bite comes out but it's, it's bounced awkwardly off the wall and it's Heading over towards Yellow Box now. Roden is just going to try and break this wall down as much as possible. Miss a few shots on him, but in the end, it will be broken down. Ponked is just waiting to take out his head there. And look at that. He is going to be uh, traded out for it by his own team's... Uh... Ouch. I think he was slowed down in there anyway, but Hoppy, he comes through. Two headshots. Coming around with another. That's three. Logan will finish it out. This is something that Finest do a lot on Icebox, it seems like. When they were playing it yesterday, they were buying up into second round. But Live is actually going to take down Logan immediately. Roden gets a trade. Down to a 4v4. Now 10k will take out Taggers. Not without a lot of damage coming out. Akuma onto Ponked. 3v3. Trades coming out back and forth. 
10k is going to be caught out there, but oh, Rodan's coming around the corner and they didn't realize he was there. Now the spray down through the smoke. Resident will take that. Akuma trying to make his way onto site. He has a Bulldog. It's a little higher power than the Spectres that the rest of the players are holding. Take the defuse. Turn around the corner, but 10k's there for that one. The Poison Orb. Just going to try it and give some cover. Fake the uh, defuse. Hoppy's turning back around the corner. Takes one onto Resident. Brilliant play there to fake that one. And, ooh, trying to find 10k, but 10k's going to run away with the Poison Orb of his own. Turning around the corner on this one and size him out. Oh, Hoppy's going to take it and just about get the defuse, I think. Oh, quite easily, in fact. Commit to the A site, though. They could still rotate out of it, but, you, may, you know, look at the way that BDS is set up. They are set up for that eventuality, if it should happen. And I don't think it's going to. Look at where the spike is. It's much deeper into the site mm. than it would be if they were looking to rotate. Yeah, absolutely. They get through and do a lot of damage there, and it means that Akuma now has to take the lead on trying to retake the site. Alive is just holding this corner down, but, oh, no, the spike is down now. Cut off by the poison orb, luckily. So being able to pick it up there, Resident, he's going to go for the plant. Nobody's there to spray through the smoke and get him. So they get round onto site now. Now they have to set up post plants. Akuma, though, he's big with the first headshot there. Turning around the corner, he's not actually going to get caught out. Hoppy takes out Foxy as well. It's just Resident Live, 58 HP, 1v4, turning around the corner. He knows. He tried to attack onto both sites and struggle oh. with both. That's a nice opening kill from Alive, but it's got to be followed up with. Yeah. Rodan was pre-aiming in the position that you'd expect Jets to go through for that jump, but it has given Alive two picks now, that trade out from him, but Akuma will spray him down through the smoke. He's caught out of position, and everybody is revealed too from the finest side, and it's actually just kind of been turned on its head after that great first pick. Now, the BDS side have congregated around the B site. They put up that wall to make sure nobody's going to get that quick plant. And Tak is just watching this angle. They have weapons. They have... Great amounts of time that they can work with and Finest, they're sweating over towards Yellow Box there. They're going to have to rethink their strategy. Out comes the lockdown, it looks like. Turret, give them a little bit of position. There's the lockdown. Now, BDS can destroy this if they want to. But at this point, yeah, there's no position to get it. They're going to have to back out. Precedent oh. trying to move forward to get a kill, but he won't be able to land them. In fact, two taken from Takas. So I suppose that lockdown oh. didn't mean too much if you're Team Finest. But Finest, they're actually heading towards B this time. They have the Operator in hand. And we know what Alive can do with that, so we'll have to see if he can find his first pick. Oh, Rodan not quite finding one. Punked will double peak Hoppy with Alive there and find that... Wait, I thought Alive had the Operator. Never mind, he doesn't. He has a Phantom, so ignore what I said earlier. They do get onto site though, and the Hunter's Fury, that's going to push away Punked. And it's chasing him too. Rodan will take one down onto Foxy. And Logan finds Alive as well. And it's all turned on its head here for Finest, who thought they had a pretty decent position. Now they've got three players and they're all spread across the map. Where Rodan is positioned as well makes this so hard to make rotates. Uh, and the way that Finest was set up, they had two players over uh, by B. Sorry, three by B, two by A. And immediately BDS responded oh, by placing yeah. defenders in <laughs> mid. And that is what happens when you place defenders in... ...to buy up fully. So, Takas, it doesn't even matter. How are they going to die if they keep taking the first shots and Punk is already down? Here comes Rodan. He's got to pick onto Resident with that operator. Takas is going to turn around the corner, look for a second. He's not going to find it. Foxy's running away at this point. Who wouldn't? But now it's Finest again with three players left, and they have no positional advantage to speak of. They're going to try and push up mid, but Logan's already watching this. Akuma's already taken up position in Kitchen. We've got one over towards B. We've got Alive over towards A. Everything. It's not working out for Finest. It doesn't matter what they do. Alive. He's going to head towards B. Look for a pick, but I, like the BDS seem unfazed. They don't care. They're just playing it slowly, safely, and Hoppy... He just one taps alive. There's no need for any any kind of uh Oh, there's Tenke. He finds one. There we go. Okay, it's back in the hands of Finest to Oh. Is it? Uh, come on man. I just wanna I just wanna make a storyline happen. Here comes Foxy, he looks for one. No, Akuma! Nation's alive, come on, let's see something coming out. Finest, they push towards A. Akuma's already there with the headshot. The Hunter's Fury from Foxy is going to try and find out the players. It hits Akuma and Alive is there to clean it up. Now they're pushing through. They've got one pick now. 4v4 and they come around the corner. Punk is there for the headshot. They're trying to get their first round in hand here. Logan stuck under heaven. He's going to take one pick onto Punk and that's a spike carrier. 10k finds one, finds two. They're coming around the corner. It's a 3v1. Hoppy trying to find this out. 
Can he keep his team flawless? He's coming around the corner. Looks for the first headshot. Oh. The spray down onto a live. It's 33 HP, but it's a 1v1. The spike's down. Foxy needs to try and get this back up. He's not looking up into heaven yet. Hasn't think. Oh, he's taking a look around, but it's in his head now. Oh, he will find it. There it is, the first round. Prudent. Look, look at this confidence. He's pushing through with the operator. He's already through there. Logan holding down Kitchen. He's going to be taken down by Alive. The entry fragger of the team. He will find one. Rodan. Oh my god. No! Resident. He's waiting. The trigger discipline. Doesn't know there's anyone coming. Nice. It's a good choice. He does find the kill as well. Pick up the well done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Foxy. Wow. Through the, through the smoke. That was a media. Did he see something then? Takas. 22 HP. Holding this down. Now Foxy. He's trying to turn around the corner. Oh no, Akuma takes down 10k. That takes out... Oh, actually, it takes out the Viper's bit. Not good for him. Punk. He's looking for this last kill. Takas, he can heal up off that. Keep looking at it. There we go. Up to 101 HP. He can still win this technically, but no, Foxy is there. He's he's becoming the uh, the finishing fragger of... Them. All of them from Finest be used because I think they're going to have to throw everything they can to oh, ensure no. that this round is theirs. Speaking of throwing everything he can, Alive throws down all of his knives and also gets taken down to 9 HP. Logan finishes it up. And now Finest are heading into the round with no advantages positionally. One man down. Rodan holding down mid here. And oh, oh, somehow Punk gets round there. Oh, but straight into the dome of Resident. Punk gets the trade, but Logan's already turning around the corner alive. Saves Punk's life getting that kill now. They've come back into this round. 10k is holding down B here. So the rest of the team, they're going to join him. But it's BDS who have to defend this one. And out comes the Viper's Pit to keep them away from sight. They can commit these ults now. They still have a Hunter's Fury available as well. Hoppy's getting sprayed down through the wall. Reveals two players. Two players behind Yellow Box. Knows he can't spray this down, but Takis is coming in from behind. He's got this flank coming. He doesn't know the rest of the team. They're actually pushing up into it, but he's going to take up post behind this. Wait, Foxy takes down Akuma. Oh no, the spray. It's too early and Ponked will trade it out now. Hoppy. He's alive in this Viper's Pit. He knows the rest of the... Uh, some of the kills. Oh, oh why would you just oh. run straight into Hobby? Oh, I say well. I say it like he knew. <laughs> Obviously, he didn't know. Oh, no, but there you go. Well, Fire, Punk will clean it in seconds until she can put that one back down. Now, Taka's pushing over through onto site. We'll take that advantage for the team. Trying to just gain position, and they wall up heaven. This is their nice... This is the way they like to plant up in heaven. BDS, he, yeah, Hoppy is uh, actually holding the flank, and he'll take one onto the flankers. Of which there are many. Resident takes Logan down. Logan jumping, trying to find his life. Oh, the finest. Here they come. They're coming through into this round and they take down four already. There it is. Beep, beep. I don't know why I keep doing the beep noises. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> I think it's because. Damage. Takes away his armor. It's a nice saving grace for that one. Oh, oh God, alive. He's been shocked there. Logan will find Punked as well. That opens up this area a little more for BDS. And Alive is actually kind of stuck here. He can't really drop down either side. Broden takes down Resident. And there's Alive. Akuma onto Alive now. Two players left on the finest side. They have to try and keep their grip on the B site here. But how much can they do when BDS is hounding down upon them here? Broden turns around the corner. Two quick shots will take out 10k. And it's just Foxy left. Finds one kill onto Takas. Turned the wrong way. But oh, Broden. Alive, he's holding up this position. Once again, he wants to go for that flanking kind of those headshots. And Logan, he's actually going to run right into him. He's not looking the right way. Oh, God, you got to learn for your mistakes. Finest, we know Alive, they love to go for that. Oh, but, oh, oh well, no. he didn't expect the flanker flanking. Foxy, he sprays okay. down two and three. The headshots from Foxy, he's turned this round all the way back in their favor. It's just Roden left, and he might run straight into the man himself, the serial killer of the Finest side. It's a slow push from Rodan. He knows his whole team just got taken out by one man, the one-man army, and there he is with his fourth Foxy, taking the. Uh, she has she has a kind of a like a flowing hair. It might have taken out that, but Rodan, what the hell was that? Takes out one onto 10k. It's a beautiful shot and turning around the corner. He finds a second one tap onto Resident. He's completely opened up the site for BD BDS now. And I was almost going to call them a K-pop band, but Akuma, he takes out one. Foxy onto another. Rodan, he's massive with the Guardian. A life he has to try and retake it all with the Operator. He turns around the corner and gets Rodan there now. It's a 1v3 situation. And at this point, do you even, do you even want to recontest this? Do you want to save maybe? Yeah, here he goes. Yeah, he's keeping an eye on them from... 
where he is, just in case they do follow up. But I mean, this is the right shout. It's an expensive weapon, wants to hold on to it. And, um, you know, you know that BDS are going to be on match point once they take this round. So you want what you can. You need as good an advantage as possible. He does want some entry kills, so I, or oh, exit kills, sorry, I think. Not too worried about that last round loss, and they can buy up into this round too, so that's exactly what they do. Finus defending this one, and Ponked will find the first headshot onto Takas, use the heal on himself. So many BDS players revealed as well, so they have this foothold in this round. Finus, there it is, Resident finding another one. The res is used onto Akuma, who wants to save this round, and Roden, he brings it back down to 4v4 with the Operator. The knives from Roden are going to find another one as well, and they push for forward onto there. Oh, won't find the pick onto that, and Ponk takes down Akuma, the green wall. Gives them that little bit of control. Logan takes down Ponk. The trade's coming out. It's two BDS players left, and it's just 10k. Full HP. The two players on BDS are low, so, you know, if a few shots, no matter where they land, will be good for that. And they don't know he's coming from the flank, so he might be able to find this first pick for free. Oh, no, no. no. he's turned back round. Oh, and, oh, the headshot onto Roden. It's a 1v1 now. But the favor is on the attacker side. Oh, but there's 10k. Oh, my God, finest. Is absolutely incredible. And, uh... Oh my god, there's a live! And Ponked opens it up as well with a blind shot onto Takas. Knew where he was. Just saw him before he went completely blinded. Over the wall there, Akuma and Logan! They make their entrance, but alive! He finds one onto ha a a Hoppy now. Holding this angle! He finds his third! He's massive with the Operator! Will he find his fourth to close it out? No, Logan! He's there for that one. It's a 1v2 now. All to win this game. 10k. Won't just peek around the corner because he knows. He knows he needs to plant the spike to get this advantage. Seven bolts in the chamber. He'll fake the plant. And there's Resident. And they're clanging, clanging, clinging onto this game. Uh, uh. Is that they invested everything into that one. They are one orb away from uh, getting the blade storm. But that's about it. And it... It's kind of lucky that they're in that position because it means that Roden can get away with just bringing a classic and they'll just be Let able to get the uh, the blades. Ooh. Foxy won't find it. The shock dart comes out to try and move him out of location. He will find the headshot onto Punk though. That's the opening pick. Foxy has found Takas in the meantime. Resident onto Logan. Now, Roden comes around the corner. He's going to find Foxy. And... Oh, Resident isn't ready for it. Coming around the oh corner. Hey, God. he's found four. He's going to look for his A's alive. It's all on you. The 1v3. He has control of the spike. He finds his first pick on Tokuma. He's not ready. He's not ready for Hoppy. BDS 